Well, I tend to follow developers on Twitter. I'm still going to call it Twitter until the day I die because the name X is stupid. Suck it, Elon. Um, and I saw that, what do you call this? Cosmic, one of the developers, had it shadows and rounded corners. It sort of brings it all together and makes this look a lot better than it used to. And I know for most people, you're probably gonna be like, is this video entirely about that? And I'm gonna be like, yeah. Yeah, it is. And you're gonna deal with it. Ah, look, let me just put it this way for you, okay? When a desktop environment evolves, I want to be there and I want to be able to be like this is a cool feature because again like getting shadows and stuff let's turn all of it off ready and turn it back on like, look at that it actually looks quite nice now I don't know why they only applied it there I mean a small little amount of shadow underneath the taskbar or a panel goes a long way I don't think they understand that, but it does. Just the same way of having a border around um, a dock improves things a lot. Now, another new thing is slightly around it, square. So now this actually affects the dock's look. And I believe it affects the windows as well. Yes, it does. And the buttons. So that's pretty cool. I would prefer a slider and to be able to finally choose our radius but this is pretty cool too i've also noticed that i think they've changed these icons they look a little bit better now um i have a list of bugs that i usually check uh one of them is davinci's resolve it doesn't open like it should and it doesn't open at all from the desktop icon so we're gonna have to open up uh, open it normally just like that and it's supposed to start full screen but it doesn't so I have to do that I know it doesn't seem like anything but it's actually pretty big uh, for me personally because again there's no actual way to full screen Da Vinci's Resolve by just double clicking it a panel or anything you you have to do uh windows shift left right and up to make it happen uh, another change i noticed from the stable release is that the applications menu is smooth it works now uh this still feels clunky and slow like it's not the user's full refresh rate which is a bit disappointing so if they could get that worked out so that this is as smooth as everything else i think that would be really great does yeah another disappointing thing is uh custom icons are still broken that's sad but um hey we got shadows you know instead of bug fixing they gave us shadows and rounded corners Sure, that was totally worth it. I'm not, I'm just being, I'm just being evil. They did a good job. The rounded the corners and the shadows kind of actually bring the whole thing together, which is nice, but I do hope they start concentrating on bug fixes. Is this really smooth though? Yeah. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Cosmic is going somewhere yep